Five Important Lessons Young People Should Learn from Martin Luther King Jr. Martin Luther King Jr., a man who was originally called Michael King Jr., was born on January 15, 1929, in Georgia, U.S. He was an American social activist who played an important role in righting a lot of wrongs in society such as seeking equality and rights for disadvantaged African Americans through peaceful protest, among other notable things. So, how did Martin Luther King Jr. become so successful and what can young people learn from him? In this video, we'll share with you 5 important lessons young people should learn from Martin Luther King Jr. If you're new here, consider subscribing so you won't miss other interesting videos like this. Lesson 1 Take the good from the bad King was born in a relatively secure and comfortable household as the second of three children. However, he was not immune to the harsh realities of the world around him. In his early teenage years, King became a victim of racial prejudices which were common in those days. At the age of 12, the death of his dearest maternal grandmother drove King into depression and because he blamed himself for her death, he tried to commit suicide by jumping out of a two-story window which he miraculously survived. Despite these things, King's father did not go easy on him. Up until he turned 15, his father would whip him regularly much to the alarm of their neighbors. His father was once quoted telling his son that he would make something of him even if he had to beat him to death. The Lesson for Young People Growing up with a father who fiercely wanted him to be successful despite the segregation they faced and who proudly and fearlessly protested against said segregation, these circumstances molded King into the man we know him to be today. As a young person, you may have found yourself in a similarly difficult environment but that does not mean you will not become someone of consequence in life. Life can be tough and you will face challenges but it is overcoming those challenges that make you a successful person. Lesson 2. Discover Your Talents In 1942, when King was just 13 years, he volunteered to work delivering newspapers for the Atlanta Journal and his hard work earned him a position as the youngest assistant manager in the newspaper delivery station. During his years in Booker T. Washington High School, he discovered his gift as a public speaker and he joined the school's debate team where in his junior year, he won first prize in an oratorical contest. King's outstanding performance in school led to his skipping the 9th and 12th grades in high school. The Lesson for Young People It is very easy to be oblivious to the things that you are good at but it might surprise you to know that the thing that you think you are bad at might actually be your talent. In order to discover the talents that can make you successful, you need to open your mind to the fact that talents come in all forms. For example, did you know that having the ability to accurately read emotions is a valuable talent for a successful person? Take the time to reflect on your basic skills. You never know which one can turn into a wealth-bringing talent. Lesson 3 Embrace New Experiences In 1944, when King was 15, he made the decision to spend his summer on a tobacco farm in Connecticut. It was here that he shockingly discovered the peaceful relations between different races. In a letter to his parents, he wrote, Negroes and whites go to the same church. I never thought that a person of my race could eat anywhere. That same year, a well-respected school, Morehouse College, announced its intentions to accept any student that could pass its entrance exam. 
during that period when most of his mates had discarded education in favor of drafting in World War II. King chose to participate in the admissions and pass the entrance examination. It was his exposure to the ministry during his time there that he made the decision to become a minister. This choice will guide his path later in life. The lesson for young people Did you know that trying new experiences actually improves your communication skills, which in turn improves your chances of financial success? Having the flexibility and courage to embrace new experiences has its perks. For example, embracing new experiences grows your comfort zone and have a great impact on your success. Lesson 4. Don't let opposition change you In March 1955, King had the privilege to be part of the committee that handled the case of a 15-year-old black girl, Claudette Colvin in Montgomery who refused to give up her bus seat to a white man. This incident raised a lot of outrage in a community where racial segregation was being enforced. However, King's influence along with E.D. Nixon and Clifford Durr caused the case to be dropped. When a similar incident occurred nine months later, it led to a non-violent campaign and bus boycott to sensitize the community to the injustice of racism which lasted for 385 days. King's participation in this campaign resulted in his arrest. However, it had already made him a national figure and spokesman for the civil rights movement. The lesson for young people You may find yourself in a position where your methods are opposed by those around you, either out of jealousy fear of the change you are trying to bring about or their inability to comprehend your ideals, but you should stand by it. Say for example, you were moved to the corner office because you had become so indispensable to the boss and your older colleague couldn't stand for it and connived to have you moved. It doesn't mean that you stop being passionate about your job or stop being excellent at what you do. Every opposition you face on your path to success is actually proof that you are actually doing something right, so keep at it. After all, no matter how deep the darkness, bright light always shines through. Lesson 5. Be bold and ambitious By the late 1950s, King had seen how successful the organized protest could be, but it was not enough. The advent of media coverage gave him an idea. In order to truly make a difference, King needed the input of a larger community. And so, in the early 1960s, King strategically organized campaigns to advocate for the basic civil rights of the blacks while ensuring widespread television footage of the harassment and violence that the segregation was causing to southern blacks. The journalistic accounts of these events eventually produced a wave of sympathy from the general public which convinced a large number of Americans to support the civil rights movement. By 1964, the Civil Rights Act was enacted. The Lesson for Young People While there may be people telling you to start small which isn't necessarily a bad thing in order to be successful. When you see the opportunity to fuel your ambitions, do not hesitate to think big. If you are a young person and you want to be successful in life, no matter how bad your environment is, there's good to be made from it. Take the time to discover your strengths. They will make you wealthy. Open yourself to new encounters and broaden your horizon. Nathanael once said, If we believe tomorrow will be better, we can bear a hardship today. And lastly, be ambitious in your vision. Thank you for watching our videos. We'd like to give you another interesting video for you to enjoy next. But before then, our team will be very happy if you can like this video and share it with your friends on social media. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe so you won't miss other interesting videos like this. Look at your screen now to see two other videos we handpicked for you to enjoy next.
We love you.